so I have a miracle fruit plant I've told you about. Yes. And it's we have a cold front coming through tonight. We've been in the 80s for highs, low in the high 60s. So that's fine for the miracle fruit, but it's from Africa. So it doesn't like real cold. So I was going to prepare it for the cold, put the uh, plastic around it and uh, a sheet over the top and a plastic tarp. And um, I went online to double check the amount of cold it can take and when I need to cover it. And um, when I was on the website reading, it said that um, it only makes flowers and fruit off last year's established wood. And I said, well, that that doesn't look right. So I went outside and looked at the plant. And on new vibrant growth that's only a few months old, I have flowers. So then I started looking and I had several green twigs, which means they're only a few months old. And they have flowers on them. Which which means the aqua energizer is doing something dramatic to it. Yeah, this is this is like what we've seen with other plants. When did you start using the aqua energizer water? Uh, when I got that extra device from you, I would use it maybe once every two weeks as a supplement. So, I don't remember what month that was. Do you have a do you have a sense? Oh, uh, at least four months. Four months. Nice. And will that thing keep putting out twigs all year round? Uh, if it's hot, yeah, and when it, when it gets cold, it won't. So since we've had a mild winter here, actually hotter than normal winter, it decided to just keep growing. But uh, it, it's not supposed to be um, flowering now, and it's definitely not supposed to be putting out flowers on new growth. The, the leaves are still small on the twigs, and it's making flowers. And it's usually making them right where the flowers are. Um, where, where the leaves come out, like on the actual yeah. bed. Well, this is doing it in the middle of the sticks, even. Quite Super unusual. Cool. I looked I looked online, and I couldn't find any pictures of fruit growing in the middle of the sticks on any of the, the pictures, so I'm going to take a couple more looks tonight. Nice. So how would you describe what you think is happening in the plant? I, I think that... Something is giving the plant an innate ability to absorb energy exponentially, making it so so much in homeostasis that that all it wants to do is reproduce. Nice. That it, it is putting it in, in such a, a state of happiness and joy that uh, it, it needs to just make more. Well, that's fantastic. We like plants that are in happiness and joy. Yeah, and this is its first year. Um, usually a, a miracle fruit plant has to be about three years old, at least two and a half foot tall. And this one was about 36 inches tall. It's almost 48 now. This last, oh, month or so it's had a tremendous growth. So I'm not really um, I'm not really sure why and how it's growing that much. Everything on the internet shows it uh, has a, a tremendous amount of growth, but it's naked and spindly, and this is filling in quite well. So I, I would believe that the Aqua Energizer is doing something to the plant that it it hasn't. Hadn't, hadn't seen or experienced ever in its short life of three years. Nice, man. Well, thanks for sharing that with me. I'm excited. Yeah, usually it might have, oh, 10 or 15 uh, uh, flowers on it when you go to Disney and you take the little boat ride through the, the stuff, you know, you see five, six uh, fruit on it and eight, 10 flowers. And I think I must have 35 to 50 flowers. Wow. <laughs> so they have these plants at, at Disney, huh? Oh, yeah. They'd probably yeah, be pretty happy if they had an aqua energizer, too. 